share with you a little something that happened to me the other day. I had a chance to meet this young lady and she was telling me a story about her boyfriend. And I said, well, what happened? She said, well, he was trying to get fresh with me. And what he wanted to do was run his hand under my dress. And I told him, my mama said, don't let no fellas run their hands under your dress. That, that's not ladylike. She said, but uh, I told him I had a better idea. <laughs> if he would have run his hand down my back, it would be the second place he got to. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so uh, anyway, this is Well, <clears throat> this morning I had a chance to, uh, I had a chance, to, I'm gonna get serious right now, folks. Uh, this morning I had a chance to go to church. And uh, they set me in a pew behind the mothers of the church. And I overheard that conversation while I was there. One said to the other one, oh, honey, that minister, he preached so long today. Oh, my behind went to sleep. And the other sister leaned over to him and said, yes, he sure did. She said, my behind went to sleep too. She said, yes, I know. I heard it snore a couple of times. <laughs> so, so, <laughs> I tell you, I tell you, yes, indeed. <laughs> well, that was, um, do you guys know what you get when you open up an elephant's trunk? Two six foot boogers. So right now we're gonna put your hands in. We wanted you to put well that was for the kids, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we gotta have one for the kids. Yeah. Alright, so anyway, I just want to share with you that there was this guy, he went to the doctor and he said, Hey doctor, he said, Look at this. And the doctor looked and the doctor says, Oh my goodness, man, where did you get something like that? He said, from sticking it in beans. He said, what kind of beans? He said, human beans. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, that was the I went, <laughs> I, went <laughs> I, I went to the World's Fair, and, and while I was at the World's Fair, this guy he came in and he had an epileptic fit, and the kids thought it was a new ride. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he threw me off two times. <laughs> anyway, and this little girl, she went to her mother and she said, Mommy, she said, can you tell me what a lesbian is? She said, lesbian? She said, I don't know, go and ask your father. She'll tell you. That was this new way. And on that honeymoon night, the bride decided to tell the groom, uh, you know, I have been with another man before I'm confessing. So the groom looked at the bride and told her, yeah, I'm going to confess tonight too. I've been with another man myself. <laughs> There's an equal opportunity here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't want anybody jumping on me, you know. Right. <laughs> Anyway, uh, that was this man had taken his wife out to dinner, and uh, after the evening was over, they was at this uh, argument at the restaurant, and they speak in code. So the wife said, "EF," and the husband says, "No, FF." She said, "EF." The husband said, "FF." So the customer heard all this. He came over and he said, "Excuse me, but..." Uh, I'm in mean, this conversation, what's going on here? He said, oh, we speak in code when we're out in public. Oh, well, uh, what is this EF and FF? He said, well, what my wife is saying is eat first. So, moving that along. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, well, we're gonna we're gonna move this show right along because <laughs> oh, it's finally getting there. Somebody's getting it. Yeah. 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 Yeah